I say no one heights, man. Honestly, I've had some height instances where... I told you this when I first met you. I mean, I've known you since the 90s. Yeah. I mean... I was a fan of you on Road Rules. We both did Road Rules a season apart. When I used to do the um, Road Rules show, we used to have to do height stuff, bro. Sometimes really? It was so I don't scary, do well bro. with it. You did that thing where you guys all walked from on that, that balance beam from air balloon yeah, to air balloon. Yeah, the first thing I ever did on there. One time we had to walk between two hot air balloons on a plank. Oh. And it was for crazy, what? huh? For ratings? No, for I think $1,500. When the kid was freaking out, that one kid, and he was like, guys, seriously, I'm really <laughs> nervous. No one make any jokes. So they're like, James, you're up next. And you went, dead man walk. <laughs> so. Came a long way, bro. Yep. <laughs> That's a good point. I feel bad that I'm just looking at Tom mostly, not looking well, at you. Well, I mean, is that okay? It's yeah. fine. Dude, look I know where that's you your husband. Look. I don't want to be looking at your wife. Look where you, know? you look. I mean, it's, yeah, just look where you look, man. Yeah, I don't care. It's okay. okay. He's very I'll look handsome. over at you sometime. <laughs> You know, did you ever hook up with any of the on the any of the cast on the on yeah. the reality show? Yeah, um, yeah, yeah I'm yeah, sure. Yeah. I got a couple hand yeah, jobs yeah, or yeah. something. Think about it. It right. was so long ago. Yeah, you were partying too, probably. Yeah, I was just partying. I was just what like college. At nineteen, honestly. S eight, seven, sixteen years ago now. Seventeen, eighteen years ago. You think it was just handies back then? I think there was some older woman that I kind of had sex with. I think once. The older woman that I kind of had sex with. Did grandma still come? Bro, this is, we're going to take this part out. We have a lot <laughs> you of You started. I just was wondering if grandma's come. I don't know. Yeah, but you think kept about... it going. I can understand a guy says something every now and then. That was Bush on. Gore right there. That, that was, was Bush dude. Gore. Oh, dude. I thought, yeah, I've been with a girl on her period, an older woman. Uh -huh. That's what they used to call Bush Gore. <laughs> what else we got here, man? <laughs> That's what they call it? Okay. That's kind of the story of my life, okay. dude. Uh, yeah, Do you like older ladies? Not. No. You still you still hook up with the ugly ones or what? No, these days I mean I, I try to find that you know a little bit of beauty in everybody, but sometimes you got to really get in there to see it. You know. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> you guys share, sleep in the same bed or not? What? What? Is this real? Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. 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 Of course. That's crazy, man. Wait, you Are don't you plan on that? <sighs> My biggest thing is just commitment issues. Yeah. Do you want to get married one day? I don't know. I bet I don't know if I could sleep in the same bed. I don't know if I could sleep in the same house, but I do envision it. <laughs> Wait a minute. Why? Yeah. That's... It just really scares me. I don't know if I could live with somebody. I don't even have a girl. I'll say God, this. I'm so I'll... fucking lonely. Bro. I'll, I'll... <laughs> oh, man. What are you afraid of? What's your biggest fear with commitment? Right now, even saying it makes Why? me feel uncomfortable. I don't know, dude. If I knew, man, I would know, you know? Like you got way more experience than I do. You know what I'm saying, dude? Do you, you know want children? That you know you don't have. Oh, I would like to have me. I would like to hatch a little bat sometime. I'm looking for a wife at some point. Hopefully you find one. Oh, damn. How, okay. how old are you? Oh, that's kind of like, <laughs> God, damn. My shot's fired. <laughs> I don't damn. know. I, I don't even want to know. Look, never mind. We're good. No, it's all love. I, I meant that with all love. It did wow. not well, sound like we that. We should listen back to it because <laughs> it sounded hella different, dude. No, I, I hope you find one. <laughs> well, even that sounded like a little <laughs> tough, boo-boo. Damn. <laughs> Uh, I don't have that. I don't have a marriage experience. Yeah. I've been in, you know, I've had bad sex with probably with countless women. How much yeah. pussy did you get? I mean, I feel like I probably didn't please a lot of women. <laughs> yeah. You know? Hundreds? Were we about to say hundreds? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but was there a lot back then? I mean, they had, they had, they had pussy back then. <laughs> Yeah, enough, I've made good girlfriend choices. It's just like the messing around choices where you're like, oh. So you're out there. You have you were able to establish brief relationships, one night stands, a little bit of sex here and there, a little bit of touch and jerking off next to someone sometimes, or even just jerking off by yourself and wishing somebody was there. You know, which is really that was probably two out of three times. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I was, like, I was gonna say, lady. like only one of those sounded like a relationship. I'm not good at sex. Like not I'm good, good. at getting there, bro. Thing. Yeah, not at all, not dude. Sure. Yeah, dude. Nobody's provided more bad sex across America than your boy right here. <laughs> really? Oh, I'll put that up against anybody, bro. Do you play the game? Oh, I'll go eleven rounds of passive sex <laughs> with a couple of reading breaks. <laughs> but uh, but I am, yeah. Other than that, I'm not, I'm not, I, that's not my main thing, you know? I'm not really that hit, man. I send somebody else in the fuck, I'll come in at the end, you know? I, that kind of cleanup hitter, you know? Oh, yeah, you kind of freaking. <laughs> I mean, I just. <laughs> you the cleanup hitter. Wait, what's the worst? Tell me, like, the worst. 
there was a girl who I had taken a bunch of stuff from Holiday Inn, and this is back when Holiday Inn put wrote Holiday Inn on their like on the shower curtains and stuff in their showers. <laughs> she took the shower curtain. And no, but I'd hooked up with her at her place, and then I took all that stuff and redid her bathroom in it, <laughs> and put all Holiday Inn shit in there. But that had nothing to do with her. I think she was okay. <laughs> uh, there was. <laughs> And then my first girlfriend, she played softball. Uh-oh. Dude, one of my first girlfriends had real short hair, dude, and she looked like a young man. And she was strong. Mm -hmm. God, she was strong. I whooped that butt. And I think she was a woman. And uh, I don't know That's... if I really wanted to be her boyfriend, but I don't know if I had a choice. Yeah. You know, and she, I remember the bus would come by. She would pick me up and start making out with me. <laughs> pick God. you up. Yeah, she was strong. <laughs> Bro, it was so <laughs> embarrassing. <laughs> and sometimes I would wrap my legs around her. I didn't know what else to do, bro. <laughs> she was like, a, she was. And you loved it. I didn't have, I was scared. I was scared, man. And then the worst part was the bus would be there and my brother and his friends, they would yell stuff at us out of the bus. <laughs> How old was she I compared know, to you? Man. Like I don't 27? Know. Yeah, I think I don't even know if she went to our school. <laughs> <laughs> it could have been a woman. <laughs> I was actually sharing a bed with a friend of mine, and we were just sharing a hotel room with a buddy, and then we each met some girls one time. So so, so where I left it at it was a yeah. mo it was a hotel, first of all, which put you out of my fucking dating class i like a motel you know what i'm saying i like thin windows you know what i'm talking about i like it when a truck goes by you fucking know what type of truck it was just from the fucking morse code of that window rattle you know you know i like that thing i like a couple of fucking flies in the room you know <laughs> and we uh and i palm and i woke up and i had punched like i it just no happened. reason no were you drunk it would no it was a scary just skim scary dream or something that happened it definitely woke her up <laughs> You know, she was like, I think I have to go pee. That was it. They had. Imagine being 19. You're a good looking dude, right? I'm like an eight. As long as I brush my teeth, I'm an eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude, we have some shit toothbrush that's trying to yeah. sponsor us. Jeez, <laughs> this is so much better than my podcast. <laughs> Well, like, like, what's your idea of like, a, like you're gonna get to know a girl? What are you doing? Like, you, hey, the... probably go for a like a walk, like a local walk. I don't know. I don't like getting. I don't know if I like getting to know people that much. You know, a, a local walk, like opposed to where, like going somewhere, like getting lost. I guess you know what I'm saying. Like, I ain't fucking getting adventurous. I ain't going for a fucking nine mile walk in one direction, bro. That's really dangerous, man. Especially in New Orleans, you know, it's wow. got that real a lot of human vampires, dude. A lot of dudes are trying to just sink their teeth into your dick out there at mm -hmm. night, you know, out, out around a French Quarter. Sounds like my kind of party. Uh, all right, on, dude. You know, I hooked up one time with uh, Jared from Subway's sister one time a long time ago. Okay, but I'll also say this: that his sister allegedly gave me a BJ, <laughs> a blowjob from uh, sixteen years ago in the French Quarter in Louisiana. For reals? Yep. In the, up, in a long time ago in the French Quarter. Damn. Okay, but it was a long time ago, but it was still, you know, it happened. Did you know it was Jared's sister? How did you know it was who her brother was? People knew. She knew. <laughs> Damn, look at his sister, bro. Yep. She busted. <laughs> Damn, you're strong. <laughs> she wasn't. Look at Matilda's mom, Dude, bro. Are you? <laughs> She's a bob cut. <laughs> Dude, you look like a lesbian golf pro, dude. You bro, fucking look horrible bro. right now. He's yeah, in dude. prison, dog. Don't worry about yeah, coming dude. after you. He liked those four. He liked those four inch rounds, baby. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? yeah. Bro, you fucked your sister. <laughs> what are you talking about, dude? I got to correct. Uh, that was bad googling. That was his ex wife. Oh, uh, thank God. <laughs> the Matilda look a woman. <laughs> well, oddly, I wrote, she looks vaguely familiar. That's the tough part. Don't touch me, dude. But yeah, look, everybody's been jerked off somewhere by somebody they didn't know if they wanted them to or not. Well, I have <laughs> probably. Did I remember the first time, girl? When I first started dating a girl, when I first sprayed out around a young lady, it was this girl jerked me off off of this boat dock. I mean, what? Everything is outdoors for you guys. Uh, yeah, well, like that, yeah. first time it ever happened to me, and it was stream, like a little kind of s still water by our house. You got a hand job out of that. 
But into had, the stream. Into the stream. And, yes. and a bunch of fish came up and ate the semen. Oh, shit. So it fucking <laughs> blew my mind, dude. Right in front of me, dude. And I had these crazy dreams after that. No, uh, really? I think it was something about but that. But hadn't you ejaculated before and felt the same way? Or and I would have dreams that there was like going to be sharks out in the ocean that looked like me and shit. You know oh, what I'm saying? Shit. I was yeah. fucking tripping. I was yeah. like, holy shit, man. You know what I'm saying? What and thought. I thought there was going to be like, what happens now? I was so scared. Right. And I was afraid to tell anybody. Um, <laughs> because I everything had just happened i just came this girl was right there the first time somebody had seen me come and then these fish came up like what if like uh like fish vons came yeah, out of the water right saying. just little fish with your head on them <laughs> dude i met a girl in miami over by joe's crab shack and bought nine of those gas station dick pills those rhino 600s or whatever right there you go, Rhino 7. This yeah. was the early, dude, this was the early recipe. It was rocky, bro. First ones they came out with, it bro. Worked? No, it made my freaking nose bleed, dude. <laughs> <laughs> so no joke, bro, I'm making love to this woman. I remember going to this girl's house one night in Florida, and I'm trying to engage in sex, and my nose just starts <laughs> bleeding all over her. Bro, couldn't fucking, I couldn't bend my fingers, right? <laughs> And my nose kept bleeding. Yeah. Bro, they wouldn't even make my dick hard. Yeah. I met at like this nice seafood restaurant, dude. I don't remember her name. She was a little bit older. They, <laughs> dude, and I was up. You're lucky to be alive. That then, is fucking. Oh, dude, and my nose was bleeding. I must have lost. I don't know how much blood I lost that night, but I'm not that good at sex. <laughs> <Second job. laughs> so oh, don't you go can lying we get, actually, can we get... And I would keep taking them, man, because I thought, oh, maybe I didn't take enough. But that was the first time I ever had snow crab. I remember that. Yeah, it's a good thing you remember that, even though your brain was bleeding, <laughs> that you hung on to that lovely memory. Yeah, it'd be great if like women send in confessions. Yeah, I slept with Theo That's in Tennessee. Oh, and... That'd be totally fine. Send in some audio confessions. <laughs> yeah. That'd be good. Yeah. But you got to send them in about everybody. I don't want to be the only one. Well, well no, I don't want to be the only one. Oh, now y'all don't want to fall. Time stamp it. We'll take that out. Time stamp that. Oh, you taking your boner pill and going home, huh? And we all show up to the court, huh? I see what's going on. Yeah, I think that sometimes. Like, I drove past Tiffany Lane's bowling alley yesterday on Highway 190. Oh, yeah, I lost my Virginia behind a bowling alley, dude, which is crazy. Yeah. <gasps> Tiffany Lane's over there. I was, I think, maybe 15 or something behind a bowling alley in our town. <laughs> and you could hear the pins going down inside, you know, give me power. That's from <laughs> I felt like it did anyway, you know, just... Behind a bowling alley. Yeah. How, who, who was the young lady? It was a girl. It was a, how old? <laughs> yeah, we were both children, and that's legal. That's such a. Um... And people were throwing rocks at us. There was these kids. Oh my God. And people started throwing rocks at us as well. Oh, shit. Pretty cool. What? Yeah, very why? Middle Eastern. I don't know why. <laughs> Middle Eastern. <laughs> just like in the Gaza Strip, <laughs> or like in the Middle East. <laughs> and I was just doing what I could, man. I was like, it was almost biblical, you know, a couple yeah. of chapters of it. It was just like, this is, you know, I felt bad. Like They're throwing rocks. Yeah. They didn't like it. Well, there was this one kid, definitely, and something's wrong with him. I mean, no, nothing's wrong with him by our standards. Something's not, you know, God didn't put him down here at 100%, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> if you will. And, uh, but so she took a piece of shale to the neck that I fucking stayed, stayed on. Oh, dude, I can still. Yeah, that's that Louisiana shit. She's like, is that a hickey? Uh, <laughs> nah. Not for me, brother. You know? She, I, it might not before. have been rocks. It might have been shale stone, but it was still <laughs> hard enough, dude. <laughs> That so might be just, a limestone hickey, but that ain't for me, so you, Dad. So you just, it's hard to fuck when people are throwing rocks wait, at you, dude. It's like were, the Middle East, you were know? Were you in a car? Yeah. It's like the Gaza Strip. At that point, it's I feel like semen is just hiding under your skin, ready to get out any way it could. You have to get it out. Like, you break your arm and just come all over the place. Yeah. You know, like any, like, oh, wow, the government's going to have to clean this up, you know? <laughs> A lot of fucking people are going to fucking fill out insurance claims, <laughs> but it's bullshit. But it's hard to stay hard when you people throwing rocks at you, especially when you're That's young. a good metaphor for, for life. Yeah. It's hard to stay hard when people throwing rocks at you. <laughs> yeah, thanks, man. But so they're just throwing rocks at you? you trying yeah, to people were throwing rocks. rocks. They were excited or they were trying to, you know, cause mayhem or something, you know, or just be a part of it. I think they were jealous. It's so like, I can't be there with this rock, Will, and they were like, throw a rock over. Okay, so here's a question just weird for you. kids. Okay, so were you in a car? Were you outside? Outside, outdoors. So you were standing? Yeah. Up against like a truck or something, I picture? No, a building. A building. Yeah, How did this go respect down? respect for me and the lady. <laughs> well, you were having rocks thrown at you. I don't, it I was mean, a bowling alley. And that's how they celebrate? <laughs> Some of these kids. Yeah, yeah, yeah get them, <laughs> <laughs> Get them, bro. <laughs> the fuck? 
How did this like happen? How did you? We go, were in okay. love. We were in love. Oh, you? It was your girlfriend. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. And so I'm taking him behind the bowling alley tonight. Yeah, I. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Break wish. out the fucking buckets of gravel in the distance. <laughs> Let's fuck, you know. Let's party, dude. Fire Get your away. Rocks ready. Fire away. <laughs> She must like you. Did you talk to her after that ever? Yeah, I just got a text from her the other day, man. Really? Yeah, we had some issues later on. We were looking for a court date. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah.